I never knew you in life. Your first life, anyway. You died on a battlefield long before my time. Something special brought us together. They called it the Traveler. And when it arrived, it changed your world forever. It was a golden age. And for centuries, humanity thrived. Until it didn't. An ancient enemy pursued the Traveler across the universe. Humanity faced extinction. But the Traveler made a choice. Its sacrifice destroyed its ancient enemy and brought life to the ghosts. I am a ghost. More importantly, I'm your ghost. And you are one of the Traveler's chosen. You are a guardian. This is your destiny. Cora, if you tell me this is a practical joke, well, it kills me to say it, but I, I would be really impressed. Impressing you, Cade, is the easiest thing I'll do all day. Let's get serious, people. Zavala, this is my serious face. Can't you tell? Ikora, what have you got? Someone or something has sabotaged the Skyline defense systems. And comms have been spotty for the last few hours. Every sensor beyond the wall has gone dark. Hmm. Maybe it's just the storm. Maybe it's... What are the set feeds telling us? Nothing. Well, that's good, right? No. I mean, they're not there. There are no satellites. And that's not good. Battle stations! Our approach. This is City Hawk 723. Anyone home? No response on any channels. Even the emergency frequencies. What is going on back there? Remember when I told you that you fly too fast? Forget I said that. Fly fast.
Let's get moving. We need to find Zabala, Ikora, and Cade. It doesn't make sense. The Cabal conquer systems by blowing up planets. Whatever they want, it must be here, in the last city. This is Commander Zavala. Civilians, report to evac points. Guardians, rendezvous in the plaza. Our city will not fall. Kate. Hey, you two. Give me a sec. Zavala's doing the hero thing in the plaza. Me? I've got a date with whoever's behind this. It'll be a short date. Over here, Hunter. My armory is open to you. Follow the path from there. It will lead you through the hangar to the plaza. I'll take care of these people. If the Cabal want war, give them war. Evacuation order 77 is in effect. This is not a drill. All civilians report to designated evacuation areas immediately. Look at the size of that thing. It must be their command ship. Okay, my ghost keeps tagging these cabal as Red Legion. Akora, what do you got? They're elite, ruthless, and rumor is they have never known defeat. Until today. Today they face guardians. But Zavala, they're attacking the Traveler. The Traveler waits. We protect our people at any cost. These Red Legion are well trained, but we are better. We will hold this line until the last civilian is safely away. Incoming! Fall back to my team! Don't let them pass the gate. The evac shuttles are back there. Hold here. That command ship is next on the list. Missiles! Stay inside my shield! Guardians are made up! Savala, the 
last of the shuttles is away. But the speaker, he never made it. I'm going to look for him. I've got the plaza. Go with Ikora. Find the speaker. We're on it, Commander. Ikora! The speaker is gone. Red Legion, you will take no more from us. And you will find no mercy in me! Zavala. She'll find the speaker. We need to move on that command ship. Now head to the North Tower. I'm sending Amanda Holiday to pick you up. Holiday is inbound. We need that ship off the field. Told me you need a ride. Zavala, picked up that guardian you never showed up about? Get him on that command ship! Now! Hold on back there! Do something. <laughs> All right, Guardian. Time to kick him where it hurts. Let us know when the shields are down and we'll hit that ship with everything we got. Destroy the turbines. The shield should fizzle. Yes, just like that. Heat levels rising. It's working. Down. Zavala? Amanda, we're headed topside. Amanda! How do we come back from this? Guardian, something's wrong. Never 
deserve the power you were given. I am Gaul, and your light is mine. Emergency broadcast. Rendezvous coordinates. They're evacuating the planet. We're on our own. Careful. 
it's that falcon again. Is it following us? Or are we following it? Somebody left a perfectly good guardian lying around. Things must be worse than I thought. And that's our cue. Time to go, people! Uh, but wait, where, where are you all going? As far away from here as possible. That falcon, it belongs to you? The name's Hawthorne. And this is Lewis, best pilot we got. What about you? Fit to fly? Probably gonna need one of these, too. Time to make yourself useful, Guardian. All right, people, spin them up! Got a long flight ahead of us! city is secure. Those who fled are being hunted, and those foolish enough to remain have been executed. Victory, as with all things, is yours to claim. This victory is as much yours as mine, old friend. All that remains is the completion of the cage around this great machine. Then we may begin the extraction of its power and put it to its rightful use. They call it the Traveler. I would contend that other civilizations may be more precise in their naming. Its functions can be controlled and exploited, as we have so clearly proven. Yet they believe it to be a god. Dominus. Gaul. We have spent our lives, you and I, working to reshape our society, reforge our people, rebuild an empire nearly destroyed by Callus's greed and corruption. There is nothing in this universe greater than you. The Red Legion will have that machine's power. You will be called Emperor. What more would the Dominus have? I would have words with my guest. up on the European dead zone. Gonna be our new home for a while. Look, do you recognize it? That's where we're supposed to go. That thing? They call it the Shard of the Traveler. I call it not a place you want to go poking around. Anything worthy of a closer look. Oh. I'm glad to see you safe. I am Tyra. 
Kyra Karn. I'm sorry. Have we met before? Losing my connection to the light has been disorienting. Now, I understand you seek the shard of the Traveler. I too have dreamt of it. Its jagged, broken edge. A wound that never heals. But I do not trust its pull. Like us, the shard no longer knows the light. Not since the Traveler cast it off during the collapse. For centuries it has twisted and corrupted everything around it. Where it lies is now a place of death. If you are determined to go, remember, we Guardians are no longer immortal. This is... Whew, lot of civilization. For me, at least. Of course, I've been living outside the city half my life. So, huh. anyway, heard you want to go poke around that busted up hunk of traveler. <laughs> you guardians have a weird idea of a good time. Oh well, Lewis and I know plenty about trusting your gut. So I'm not about to stop you. I got enough to deal with here. Take that ship you flew here. At least, it'll get you back faster. See all these refugees? I haven't lost one yet. Don't you be my first. Want to do this? That shard is the reason this place is called a dead zone. We have to, Hawthorne. It's a sign. Yeah, a sign that says dead zone. You know, I've been all over the EDC. Charming enough. I mean, nothing says come visit like a dark haunted forest. But non guardians aren't supposed to leave the city. Here's the thing about city rules. They stop applying once you leave the city. There's a small gap in the wall. Hard to see, but it's there. Nobody goes farther than that. At least nobody who wants to come back. Let me know when you reach the Hawthorne? Hawthorne, can you hear us? Signal's dead. Those Fallen weren't wearing any house colors we've seen before. The Shard of the Traveler. This is it. Right out of our vision. Scared them away. Take me to the shard. why we were led here. I haven't been as close to the Traveler's Light since... Do you feel it? Hold on to your helmet. Do you feel it? The light is back. We're back. Eyes out, Guardian. Hold 
God for your help. you. You got your life back. I don't know how you did it, but I'm glad. Because we're gonna need it. There are a lot more survivors out there, and they need our help. We gotta get the word out that the farm is a safe haven. I sent a friend into the EDZ a few hours ago to set up a comm network. His name's Devram K. Good guy. Great shot. Don't tell him I said that. If you give him a hand, I'd take it as a personal favor. Don't get cocky now that you've got your powers back. The EDZ is rough, especially around the Old Town. Just remember, refugees from the city have it a lot rougher. Want to help them? Find Devram K. Guest, but here I have no tea to serve. These are dire times indeed. Devram K, the eighth at your service. City militia, back when there was a city. Now I serve at the pleasure of my dear friend Soraya Hawthorne. <laughs> First on the docket, contact other refugees and tell them of the farm. That means building a comm network from the ground up. And even though I happen to be a damn good shot, the fallen are giving me a devil of a time. I dare say you can handle a few rounds with the enemy. I've seen what Guardians can do. Right. I think it's time to let the guns do the talking now. Don't you? This is a House of Judgment sigil. We used to work with a Fallen who flew this banner. Curious. Well, the Fallen seem to have put this up as a bit of a threat. I imagine you'll find lots of objects like this out there. Bit of a story to them. You both need some supplies to get going out here. See if you find a cache in one of the buildings nearby. Very well done. To survive, we'll have to look for every opportunity. Keep your eyes peeled for more supplies in the wilds. Speaking of the wilds, there's a symbol on the wall of the church. Take a look. Devrim, where did this symbol come from? I believe your city hunters must have put them here and there about the region as they scouted around. I think they meant it to mark something special. Or dangerous. Or both. Let's go check it out. The history of this region is fascinating. I believe tunnels and caves like the one you're in now stretch all across the EDZ. Who knows what's lurking down there? Be careful. I just snagged a key code from that captain. I think I can open his supply cache. Down there, you two. Keep 
keep an eye out for other hidey holes and treasures like this one. But that's for another day. In the meantime, what say we get down to business? Come on back up to the church tower. I'm putting a kettle on now. Welcome back. This time I did make tea for you, but I seem to have drunk it all. Perhaps if you were a mite quicker. <laughs> right, the beacon. While you were tussling with the Fallen, we've encountered a bit of a setback. Hawthorne has placed the last relay on the mountain above the salt mines, but even from that height, the signal still doesn't have the range we expected. It's a bit curious. Regardless, this signal booster should solve our problem if we can get it to her. Hmm. Dead zone indeed. Hey, Dev. Still sitting up here above the mines with his busted comm relay. Where's that signal booster? Our new guardian friend is en route. I'm getting too old to clean up after you, Soraya. Finally, he admits he's old. <laughs> Bail me out on one assault charge, and you never let me live it down. Ah, uh, don't you mean one a week? You're the reason my hair is gray. Yeah, yeah, keep talking, old man. Elevator should take us to the top of the mines. We'll have to find another way up to Hawthorne. Careful. The Fallen are scavengers of the highest order. They're going to put up a fight for whatever they can get their grubby claws on. Ah, you'll be pleased to know that I can see the fallen fleeing the mine. Seems you've really kicked the hornet's nest, haven't you? That did it! Killing the servitor brought the power back on. Good job. Maybe I'll finally get my booster one of these days. Hawthorne, we're out of the mine and heading your way. Then hurry up with that booster. Let's finish hooking up the comm network. And, uh, thanks for the help. You're not so bad. For a fancy pants guardian. Now that's the nicest thing I've ever heard Soraya say. You're in rarefied air, my friend. You made it. Looks like Lewis owes me money. All right. Let's see if this works. Now, have I read the manual, right? There's an incoming beacon. Guardians, the city is lost. If there is any light left in the system, we rally on Titan. Be brave. Guardians, the Valas are alive! If we leave now, we can... You are not going to Titan. We've got refugees coming in. The Red Legion on one side, the Fallen on the other. But we have our powers back. And if we're going to retake the city... Your city is gone! Hawthorne, we will be back. And we won't be alone. You'll know where to find me.
would save us both a lot of time if you would just kill me. For one who calls himself Speaker, you have remarkably little to say. We've learned that one of your guardians has reconnected to the light. You say you have no power over the Traveler, yet... This... Help me understand, Speaker. The light lives in all places, in all things. You can block it, even try to trap it, but the light will find its way. And the Traveler will protect itself. The Traveler? For years I have studied it. The world it has touched. Its power over life and death. We are not so different, your Traveler and I. You are nothing like the Traveler. Nothing. You think you have power, control. I know your kind. You started small, you will end small. If the Traveler truly has chosen humanity of its own free will, then there is no reason I should not reach inside, tear out the light for myself, and leave this system in ashes. Only those the Traveler chooses will be reborn in the light. Yes. This I know. This is why I have claimed your planet, and why you still live. The Traveler will choose me, Speaker. And you are going to tell me how. Hawthorne already believes Zavala abandoned her and the survivors. Now that we're leaving, if we stayed, yes, we could help them survive. But if Zavala really is building a counteroffensive on Titan, we can save them all and take back the city. Vanguard Fleet. Guardian ship 723 is on approach. We received your beacon and we're ready to join the fight. Guardian ship, this is Zavala. It's too late. The Hive have overrun Titan. I was wrong to bring us here. Commander, we're here to help. No, we've already lost too many lightless guardians to the Hive. We can't secure this moon. We have our light back. What? Impossible. Commander, if I may. Guardian, this is Deputy Commander Sloan. We have a counter-offensive to plan. To do that, we need to get this station up and running. There's a fleet to prep, guardians to arm, and a trove of intercepted Red Legion transmissions to decrypt. It's critical we gain access to the station's control center. That's where you come in. If the light really is with you, send the hive back to hell. And Guardian, please, be careful. What was this place? The Golden Age cities of Titan were once the pride of humanity. We thought they were abandoned. But I was a fool to think the hive would not spread this far. I have a bad feeling about this.
Okay, Sloan. We can see the control center. Copy that. Keep pushing forward. Commander, at this rate, we can start planning our counteroffensive. We'll be outside the city gates in no time. If it were only that simple. I shudder to think what spell the Hive were casting back there. We should talk to Eris Morn. She would know which Hive god they were communing with. No one has seen Eris, or Ikora, or Cade. Since the city fell. A fallen antenna. Hmm. The fallen houses each used to have their own unique encryption. But now the codes they have are all variants of the House of Kings. We made it, Sloan. Perfect. Recon the perimeter before you move on the control center. like we're standing in some kind of high breeding ground. Take it out. We cleared the nest. Heading to the control center now. Well done. Sweep the perimeter and we'll move in on your signal. Approaching the landing platform. Get up here and take a bow. If the light can find its way back to you, then perhaps there is hope for us all. Our numbers will continue to dwindle. We can no longer protect ourselves, much less the survivors. And without the light, are we even guardians anymore? Commander. We won't last long with dead generators. Wave energy converters power this station, but thanks to the Hive, they're in need of attention. We can take care of it. Yes, I believe you can. We're not out of this yet. Now that we've reached the control center, we still need to power up the place before we can take care of our fleet. Commander Zavala tells me you've volunteered. I'll run tactical. Shipwright Holiday here will provide tech support. It's a straightforward op. Get in, flip a switch, get out. <laughs> Sloan's got a way of making things sound easy, doesn't she? Did we lead the Fallen here? No. Those vultures have been following us since we evacuated Earth.
the Fallen depend on their servitors to provide a substance called ether. But this one's been picked clean of ether and abandoned. Sloane, Amanda, the Hive have infected everything. Holiday, we gotta get you back in the air. We'll need ongoing aerial threat assessments to keep our perimeter secure. Oh, uh, yeah. You know my ship took a beating during the evacuation. I'll bump you to the front of the line for repairs once the lights are back on. Great. Great. We can see the wave energy converters from here. Sweet. Now just flip the switch and turn them on. Accessing systems now. Some of the pistons are moving, but we're still sitting in the dark. Something went wrong. The pistons must be jammed. Sorry, pal. But you're gonna have to go out there. Bring a workaround. We made it to the converter platforms. Okay. Get to the stalled pistons. See what's jamming them. Once they're all moving, we're in business. Oh yeah. Found the problem. The hive has gunked up the pistons. Then let's find a fix. First piston's good to go. We gave it a power scrubbing. That's great and all, but, uh, it's still pretty dark on this end. Sounds like you got more scrubbing to do, Guardian. Final piston is clear. Control center's still dark, so it's gotta be more than a piston problem. I have to get in futz with the circuit breakers. Try the central platform. Everything routes through there. Circuit breaker is going to be around there somewhere. Find it and flip the switch. Just like I said. with these intercepted enemy transmissions. It's a hell of a view, isn't it? We're up and running, thanks to you. There's plenty more to do around here, though. Chief among them, finally breaking ground on a counter-offensive against the Red Legion. I have a plan, but it won't work without you. We intercepted a Priority One Red Legion signal during the city evacuation, but we can't crack the encryption. Holiday says there's tech that can do the job in the Arcology, which is effectively hostile territory. You'd be going in blind. The place has been dark for centuries. All we know for sure is the Hive is raising hell down there, perhaps literally. But if you're in, let's put the plan into action. Holiday has detected an unusual amount of electricity being redirected into the Arcology. Yep. Juice like that can only mean one thing. A network of CPUs. Powerful ones. Maybe powerful enough to decrypt that cabal signal we intercepted. Unfortunately, we don't know where the network might be located. So, you're gonna have to snoop around, not draw too much attention. Guardian, securing this asset could turn the tide of this war with the Red Legion. Without, I don't know what comes next. The Fallen were trying to break through those tiles. Welcome to Pacific Arcology, the bright future of space colonization in the shadow of Saturn. Sounds like the Arcology's operating system is back online. I knew it. Keep an eye out for an OS access terminal. You can use it to pinpoint the CPU network.
the CPU network is deep in the maintenance levels. Amanda, is this what we're looking for? Bingo! That's the place. Okay, I've got the location. Let's find a way down. Looks like the hive dug a shortcut for us. Let's head down that hole in the ground. We're definitely in hive territory now. Keep radio chatter to a minimum. We don't want to draw any unnecessary attention. didn't hear that alarm. We got the CPU, but we stirred up the entire hive colony, and it's a long walk to the surface. Move it, God. They're not gonna make it out of there, Commander. God, can you make it to the center of the arcology? We should be able to send someone to pick you up from there. Holiday. Yeah. Yeah, I'm on it. This road leads to the center of the arcology. We'll need a way out once we get there. I'm strapping in and about to take off. I'll be there ASAP. Amanda. Sir? Fly fast. Fly safe. Yes, sir. Good work, both of you. Let's get that CPU back to control and decrypt these transmissions. Things may finally be looking up for us. Almighty, the crown jewel of the Red Legion and life's work of their leader, Dominus Gaul. Gaul has subjugated hundreds of worlds. Those that resisted no longer exist. You see, the Almighty annihilates stars. survives Gaul's ambition. What he wants is the Traveler and its light. As for the Almighty, it's now pointed at our sun. The 
In short, sir, the war's over. And we've lost. We built our home under the protection of the Traveler. When our enemies attacked, we built a wall that stood for centuries. But now walls mean nothing. This enemy has taken our home, taken our light, and now they threaten our very existence. We're going all in on this almighty. How long before the fleet's combat ready? Zavala, wait. If we wait, we die. But if we attack together, we can take back our home, our light, our hope. Or we die trying. Now, I need my fire team. I need Ikora and Keed. Commander Zavala needs the Vanguard united again. While he prepares for the assault on the Almighty, we're going to find Cade and Ikora. Luckily, we picked up an odd signal from Cade's ghost. It's being boosted somehow from a centaur called Nessus, which is strange. Centaurs are really just big rocks in the outer reaches of the solar system. There should be nothing there. So much for nothing being here. Let's get to high ground so I can pin down Cade's location. Here we go, tracking Cade's signal now. I think I'm getting something. Vex trap? What is Cade getting us into this time? Something around here is blasting that signal into space. We find that something, we'll find Cade. There! The signal's coming from that wrecked ship! Rescue the Cade 6? Whoa, you're not Cade. The Cade 6 is currently caught in a teleportation loop. He's over there. Whoop. Now he's over there. Whoop. He's moving? Well, that's complicated. I can help you. But I'm gonna be super unpleasant about it. I'm sorry. What? I have uploaded his new coordinates to you. Against my better judgment. Uh, okay. May I help you with anything else? Yeah, are you okay? You sound a little... off. I am the Exodus Black's failsafe. Call me failsafe. I boosted the Kate 6s signal in hopes he would be rescued. And look, here you are. Oh, I see. She's just an AI. A malfunctioning AI. I heard that. At your service. Centaurs are supposed to be just giant icy rocks. How did all this happen? A robotic alien entity called the Vex have achieved 92.014% conversion of the Centaur Nessus. Cade! Someone there? Listen, don't ask me how this happened. I don't have time to explain what I don't have time to understand. Warning, the Vex will vaporize you.
So failsafe, what exactly happened here? The Gate 6 attempted to manipulate the Vex portal system. He is now trapped in a non-linear loop. In my defense, I tried to warn him. He's like, not that smart. This is not going well. How long have you been here exactly? Long enough to see the Vex convert this entire planetoid, kill all living organisms, reformat molecules, and digitize brain waves for further study. It's a fascinating process. She sounds way too excited about that. I'm almost afraid to ask, but... Failsafe, what happened to the Exodus Black crew? Only my captain can access those memories. And he's super dead. The Cade 6 is just beyond that Vex gate. Please proceed. Won't we get stuck like Cade? Oh no. My judgment module is much more reliable than the Cade units. We're through. We're okay. Of course. The Cade 6 is not far now. Hey! Over here! Get me out of here! What's that? Is that a Hydra? Okay, yeah, yeah. Go pedal that first, then me. story and it may look like I don't know what I'm doing but I do maybe not it doesn't matter killing the power source at the origin point should break the loop and get me out of the portal system have you got that say you've got it see something fine I'll say it we got it Kate now how did you oh my cotton socks did you not hear what I just said I'm guessing this is why they don't like him leaving the tower Failsafe, we're at your coordinates. The Cade is stuck inside a Vex portal system. Can you help us find the power source so we can get him out? Oh yes. By locating the original Vex teleporter the Cade unit used, you can shut down the loop and free him. I can guide you there. Okay, so we find this Vex teleporter and shut it down. Easy. Ugh. What is this stuff? It's called Radiolaria. You know, Vex mind fluid. Hmm. This stuff is organic. Seems the Vex are not pure robot. What could have possibly brought Cade to Nessus? I know the answer. One, stop listening in on us. Two, what's the answer? He asked me not to tell anyone. Warning! Vex threat detected. They are blocking your path to the Cade unit's teleporter. 
You will have to eliminate them. I thought your wholesale destruction of the Vex would make me miss my captain and crew less. Did it? It did not. This is the Vex teleporter? Yes. The Cade 6 will want it. You should pick it up. Take that, you scrap heap! I'm out, baby! Out! Woo! Hey, where are you? Hey! You did it! You got me out! Ha! 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 Uh, where, where am I? Cade unit, you are near the remains of my reactor core. Welcome to the Exodus Black. Where all your dreams come true. Uh, seems like you've met my new friends, Failsafe, and her evil twin, Failsafe. Which is the evil one? If I had feelings, they would be hurt. Uh-oh. Fallon's got the Vex in a tizzy. And by tizzy, I mean murderous rampage. I'll hunker down in the Exodus Black. Here? But my hull is in 108 pieces. Decks 1 through 20 are buried. And my coolant system... Uh, I am a mess. Oh, we know, Failsafe. We know. Intruder alert! It's me! It's... It's the Cade unit? False. I mean, true. But you are attracting large numbers of Fallen to my position. Damn it! Feel safe they're shooting at me! Then I advise you not get shot. I was hoping the Fallen and Vex would finish each other off on Venus. But then you'd miss all the fun. That is a real big Vex. The gate lord's down. Hold on, Key. We're on our way. Uh, that's good to hear, because the Fallen just found us. Activating defensive shield. The Cade 6 must stand back. Hey, nice one, Failsafe. The Fallen can't get to us now. That, that's right, though. They, they can't, right? Get to us now. Hey, you probably want to hustle. I think they just said something about ripping my beautiful horn off my face. My beautiful, beautiful horn. Intruder alert. Uh, it's us. Fallen set up this terminal for remote access into the Exodus Black's security system. I could have told them that would work. That failsafe had fun with them, though.
dropped something. New captain registered. Welcome aboard, captain. Hey, hey, down, down, down. So it's true. The light found its way back to you. Not that I'm jealous or nothing, but <laughs> take it easy out there, will you? You're making me look bad. What, may we ask, were you going to do with a Vex teleporter? Get up close and personal, we go. Put a bullet in his head, then maybe eat a sandwich. Gotta work out a few kinks first. Fun fact about the Vex tech. Not as intuitive as you'd think. Cade, you can't do this alone. <clears throat> Hell, I can't. <sighs> Even if you manage to kill Gaul, when the Red Legion leave a system, defeat or victory, they leave nothing behind. The Cabal are bad guys who do bad things. Yes, I get it. I'm sorry, but I do not think you do. The Cabal literally leave nothing behind. They have a weapon that can destroy a star, and it is pointed directly at our sun. Hey, 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 easy, easy. You're gonna blow a bulb. Zavala has a plan. He needs you, Kate. Yes, well, Zavala always says he has a plan, but sometimes he just... Wait. Zavala said he needs me? As in you heard those exact words coming out of Zavala's mouth? Yes, we did. Please tell me you recorded it. Well, did Akora at least hear it? Actually, Zavala lost her after the city fell. We don't know where she is. Io. Io, it's, it's where she'd go to look for answers. Hey, um, thanks. Oh, you won. friend. I am Failsafe. I am so glad to meet you in person. I know you are going to Io. Should you return, I will be happy to assist you in researching the Vex. We could steal their stuff. That was a joke. Stealing is wrong. Usually. But the Vex are alien robot monsters. Standard moral parameters do not apply. It's not murder if it's robots. Please come visit me again. Everyone I've ever known is dead, and their bones are dust. I am very lonely. I am. The whole place hums with energy left behind by the Traveler's unfinished work. No wonder Guardians considered this site sacred. Now that Kate is back in the fold, all we need is to find Ikora, make the Vanguard whole again, and bring down the Almighty. Of all the places I've been in all the years since my rebirth, this is where I return. The last place the Traveler touched. I came for answers. I stand here still with nothing. Ikora, Zavala is forming a resistance, and he believes... What good is a resistance when you are the only one who would survive? I 
believe this goal creature knows the traveler blessed this site. I believe he sent his legion to find something they could never possibly understand. And I believe they will continue to desecrate all we hold sacred. Save this place, Guardian. Do not squander this second chance. Red Legion ships have been in and out non-stop since I got here. We need to know what they're doing. Get into that base. Look at the sky. What is that, Ikora? Energy. The Traveler's energy. What have they done? This is my fault. I could have stopped this. Ikora, there's no way. Not without your light. I am more than just my light. I could have tried. I should have tried. But after all these years, dying, being reborn, dying again, the Traveler has left me with one life. And I am afraid to lose it. That might happen anyway. Gaul has a weapon that can blow up our sun. What? Why would he destroy what he's worked so hard to conquer? Get into that base. There must be answers there. Looks like the Legion's packing up, Ikora. Find out what they're shipping. We need every scrap of intel we can get. Everyone's gone. Keep looking. It's not like the Cabal to invest so much in a base and just abandon it. We're coming up on a big drill. A drill? Are they mining the Traveler's energy? No, it's not light. It can't give the Traveler's blessing. Not to me, not to Gaul. Or could it? Ikora. What's wrong? Taken rips. Defensive wards, too. The Taken. Why are the Taken here? They have no leader. Oryx is dead. The Taken will always be drawn to the Traveler's energy. They are no longer Fallen or Hive or Cabal. Oryx changed them with the dark powers he stole. He... Wait. Is Gaul's plan to do the same, but with the light? That has to be it. Gaul must be mining the Traveler's remnant energy in the hopes of transforming himself and the Red Legion into wielders of the light. If he succeeds, he will become immortal. Unstoppable. We have to tell Zavala. Meet me outside. or something drew the Taken here. Asher Mir? Is that you? Irrelevant. The Taken are sapping the moon's energy. I hypothesize that Io will implode if someone does not intervene. Guardian, 
We cannot lose this sacred place. Do what must be done. Stop the Taken. Looks like the Taken are conjuring some kind of portal. Stop them! Doubtless those mindless vermin intend to summon every last one of their spectral friends to devour this moon. There it goes. Looks like we closed the portal. And why am I still seeing abnormal neutrino scattering? Hang on. We're gonna take a closer look. We definitely didn't close it. Ah! Remedy this mess! Portals closed. We're clear. Ikora. I know this place is important to you, but... There's nothing for me here on Io. I have one life left to give, and I will give it gladly to stop Gaul. We leave now. Don't be so hasty. Ikora Ray, we must talk. And as for you, meddling guardian, I have a few choice things to say to you. Ikora tells me that Commander... somebody... Uh, I don't care, has a plan to attack the so-called Almighty. A plan unsupported by any data. However, there are remnants of an old interplanetary defense network here. We shall use it to assess the Almighty's capabilities. Then, we will tell Zavala precisely why his plan is wrong. And oh, I will relish that. Meanwhile, I refuse to squander valuable research opportunities. Therefore, you shall be my assistant. Go. All this talk wastes my time. What? You thought a bit of apocalypse would shut down Eververse? Not likely. We have two choices here. Give up, give in. Or stand up, brush off the dirt, and face whatever comes. With style. Even in the worst of times, if you look good, you feel good. And this place? It could use a little glamour. So, what can Eververse do for you today? The dreams have changed. And now I know why. Truly, the Traveler has chosen you. Your light shines brighter than ever. As a guardian, my calling has always been as historian, not warrior. And I will ensure your great deeds will never be forgotten. I don't need light to record your deeds. For a while more, at least. Make no mistake, my friend. We are living through history. And the burden of legacy falls on you. We are 
the scattered people of a fallen city. You are our last and only hope. Be brave, Guardian. This forest again. Well, I can't say our last visit wasn't memorable. Let's see what we can find. Of the ambiance. Hey, do you see that? Over there, the light. She leaves the rifle and walks across the naked obsidian into the swarm, firing from the hip as she goes, each kick of the old revolver a word. The stone smokes around her where the arc fire lashes it, and the shrapnel guns throw up leaves of obsidian like glass butterflies. She shoots her bandoliers dry, and a team of vandals in glassy stealth leap up to rush her with knives, but she raises her hand and burns them down with the golden gun, laughing. Heads up, fallen. I think these light projections might be lessons. My old friend Andal, he used to stand right here, right in the spot. He'd come up with these wild stories. He'd say, you know, Cade, I've been examining the evidence. Personally, I've come to think it's you. You're Rasputin, legendary war mind, defender of Earth. And I wish you'd remember that so you could reclaim your full power and save us all. You can see how that'd be embarrassing. So I say what I want to say every day. It's no secret. I say, well, I'll go find it then. I'll go tell Rasputin we need its help. And Akura looks at me with one of those looks that you know, sometimes you talk to Akura and you just think, wow, you're not even using a fraction of your brain on me, are you? One of those looks. She says, Kate, the problem isn't just that we can't find Rasputin. The problem is it's not clear to any of us that Rasputin wants to be found. the shard of the traveler but we're not alone us here. I'm sure of it. radio chatter. They're calling reinforcements.
incredible. If that was a test, I think we ate it. I'm sure the Traveler called us to the forest deliberately. It's amazing that even a corrupted shard can still do so much good. As we all know, Zavala plans to attack the Almighty. Typical Titan idiocy. I'm sure he thought, ah, Gaul has a Sun Destroyer. I don't need a plan. I'll simply headbutt it. It's desperation, Asher. Zavala has forgotten he might die his final death. Head toward the heart of the energy mining operation, Guardian. We'll use a war mine. Part of an interplanetary defense network to scan the Almighty. I think we're close, but so are the Taken. Vex, too. He's of no heed, Assistant. You and I can deal with them later. Ikora, we found another drill. This one's big. Really big. Good. That drill pierced an entrance to the war mine vault. The scanner's inside. Gotcha. Let's find the drill controls and get it out of the way. Manual override somewhere in that base. I find it incredible that those myopic Red Legion ignorami did not realize they were drilling directly into a war mine vault. Stranger things happen every day. I'm detecting a spike in paracausal energy. Stero neutrino particles have quintupled. He means watch out for the Taken. You should hire a translator, Asher. that override. I think we've got the drill going. Good. Return to the drill site and get into the war mind vault. I am eager to discredit Vu Vu Zela's plan to attack the Almighty. So, uh, are we going to see Rasputin? Or is this some other war mind? There is only one war mind. But Rasputin is not here on Io. I believe he's been marooned on Earth ever since his network fragmented. Whoa, the drill's on. What? Lift it up before it collapses the war mine vault! This will be rich. I will ask Zavala. Can you tell me in Zedijules the Almighty's expected destructive capacity? And he will say, no, Asher, I cannot, because I am a reckless fool. Ignore Asher. 
Find the war mine. Reconnect it to the network, and we'll handle the rest. Reconnecting to the war mine network to begin a remote scan. Yes. We can see the connection coming online. Hang on. We've got taken. of the sun's magnetic flux tubes. What? If Savala blows up the Almighty, it'll take the sun with it. It's time I rejoined my fire team. of such power and immortality. Devotion. Self-sacrifice. Death. Death. Explain. Devotion inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. Sacrifice leads to death. So, feel free to kill yourself. Devotion. Sacrifice. I was born an outcast. A runt. As is custom with the Cabal, I was cast aside and left for dead. I was taken in by an old scholar himself disgraced, who saw in me something redeemable. He raised me. Taught me, trained me, and in return, I would become a vehicle for his revenge against an empire that failed him, that failed itself. Rejection, ridicule, torment, it made me stronger. I gave everything to win, not just acceptance, but glory. My mask, Sticker, is the face of devotion and sacrifice. I will not take the light by force. To do so would be to admit failure. And I never fail. Now, do you see why I will be chosen? I see now. I see all that you have done. Our operation on the Jovian moon was a success. Once the cage is complete, we will have everything we need to begin the process of extracting the light. Dominus, everything we've worked for is here, for the taking. All that remains is your word. No. This is not the way, old friend. But it is the way. The only way. Not for me.
So really what you're saying is, we're damned if we do, damned if we don't. On the contrary, now that we are together again, we just might stand a chance. The fact is, if we destroy that weapon, we will ignite a chain reaction that could send our son into a supernova. Well, at least we have each other. Indeed. We all know what needs to be done. The Traveler must be freed. I'm thinking the three of us and a big fat pile of explosives can get the job done. Look, I still have that Vex teleporter. It's got a limited range, so we'll have to get a little too close for comfort. Then we get inside the city walls for it to be effective. But without the light, an outright assault on the wall is doomed to fail. We could... There will be no coming back. It's worth it. How do we get in? You know... The city wall is kind of like this barn. Plenty of places to slip in unseen, so long as you know how. You sure you're not one of my hunters? <laughs> not really into capes. Clearly. Nice poncho. You need to get your team into the city without raising any alarms. My people and I can help you do that. We also happen to be pretty good at shooting bad guys. Hawthorne, it's one thing for us to put our lives on the line, but this doesn't have to be your fight. You're not a... A guardian? You think you've cornered the market on sacrifice? You forget that we've had to survive without the light all our lives. Once upon a time, that big white ball in the sky was there for all of us. I think it's about time we return the favor. Guardians or not. That's great speech and all, but let's not forget about the whole supernova and complete annihilation thingy. If we can't destroy the Almighty, we'll have to disable its weapon. And that means getting a certain Guardian on board. We'll need a good disguise if we're going to fly right through a Cabal Armada. If it's a Cabal ship you need, there's a base nearby full of them. But it won't be easy sneaking in. Oh, we're done sneaking. If there's one thing I've learned from Cade, it's the value of a grand entrance. This is great. Anyone want a hug? Hugs? No? No hugs. Remember that Cabal base round the way? One of Gaul's buddies runs it. Bloodguard by the name of Thumos. We know he's got access to the Almighty. So you crash the base, steal Thumos's ship, use it to sneak aboard the Almighty, and shut it down before it can blow up our sun. Do me a favor. Put Thumos down while you're at it. When you give the signal, we move on the city. Take it back. Gotta say, I really didn't think you'd come back from your interplanetary jaunt, much less with a vanguard by your side. Look at us. Red Legion doesn't stand a chance. Did the bird distract you? You ever figure procrastination is your brain's way of stopping you from making a terrible mistake? Yeah, me too. See, I volunteered to set up our patrol network, and I haven't done it yet. Because what if I screw it up, you know? It's so important. We use that network to run ops all over the system. Supply runs, recon, you name it. So I'm thinking, what am I gonna do? But here you are. So competent, so diligent, so ready to do things the right way. I guess what I'm trying to say is, save me from myself. I'll make it worth your while. As of today, I'm reauthorizing strike operations. Strikes will serve as the backbone of our defense against our enemies, present and future. We'll hunt down priority targets, gather intelligence on our enemies, and undermine plots against humanity. I'm counting on you to show everyone, guardian and civilian alike, what courage really looks like. But this isn't a solo detail. You'll need a dependable fire team to back you up. What is it that Cage says? Teamwork makes the dream work. <laughs> Get out there and make us proud. Losing the light was devastating. We were careless. I was careless. I took my power for granted. Never again. Wherever you go, seek out experiences that truly challenge you. Force yourself to grow. Never be satisfied. If anything dares to come between you and the light, destroy it. Let every victory sharpen your mind and body. 
and show our enemies a guardian's wrath. Guardian, you've got a tough road ahead, so I'm sending in Holiday with something special. Whoa, 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 whoa. How special are we talking here? Just keep moving. Storm the facility and board that Cabal carrier. No matter the cost, we must get to the Almighty. So, Zavala, I gotta ask you something. When you told our Guardian friend here, and I quote, I need Cade, did you by any chance happen to maybe cry? <clears throat> Holiday, what's your status? Let the record show. No denial. Still a couple clicks out, Commander. This girl's heavy. Say hello to the Drake. You got us a tank? You got them a tank? I do you ever got a tank. You know you just break it. able to shoot our way through that door. The override should be nearby. Heads up! That carrier's spinning up its engines. Might want to pick up the pace. Tumos is on that carrier. He has what you need to infiltrate the Almighty. Move! Of course the Red Legion have tanks too. Well, they've retracted the bridge. We're not going to be able to cross that gap. Oh, your super tank can't fly? Oh. So, if it wasn't to give me a tank, why did you send our favorite guardian to find me? Your... The high risk, high reward combat maneuvers can be effective. And inspirational. Well, yeah. Dang, they could be like a million times more inspirational. and coming up on the carrier. Good. The only thing standing between you and the Almighty is Thumos the Unbroken. He's a blood god, one of Gaul's chosen. The Red Legion will die for him. Why don't you help them do that? They're shielding the carrier! Those generators? We need to take them out if we're going to board that carrier.
grab it. Now let's find Thumos. Good work, Guardian. And Cade, after this is over, I'll talk to Holiday about your tank. Oh, I missed you too, buddy. Here we go. We're in the carrier. Good. Your target is Thumos the Unbroken, one of Gaul's chosen. The key codes to his ship are your ticket to the Almighty. Hawthorne had a run-in with him while you were off planet. They're known as the Blood Guard for a reason. I tell you to be careful, but that didn't help the last team I sent out. Find the command deck, and you'll find Thumos the Unbroken. And you'll break him. <laughs> The bridge should be above us. Let's find a console and dig up the schematics. Okay, I've got the map. Let's find Thumos. Careful out there. The team I lost to Thumos, they were good people. Some of my best. Our Guardian can handle it, Arthur. It's what we do. It's what you did. Last I checked, without the light, you and me, not so different. Ah, the door is sealed. Look around. There's always another way in. Checking the schematics. Got it. Use that vent. It should lead us back to where we need to be. Wish I could be out there with you. Pull the trigger myself for my team. Your time will come, Hawthorne. I'm counting on it. Almost to the hangar. By now, Thumos will know you're coming for him. Expect a welcoming party in there. Holiday, are you in range for an assist? Swinging back around. Gotta shake a couple of these red uglies off my tail first. Now go take care of Thumos for us.
Thumos is dead. Check and check. Excellent work. Now get to the base, find his ship, and get to the Almighty. We're counting on you. You did a hell of a job, Guardian. I'm gonna spread the word. Thumos is gone for good. Thumos, the Unbroken, has a ship in that base. It's the only way we can get you onto the Almighty undetected. So you're going to steal it. Newsflash, folks. The Fallen are on the move. Seems they didn't learn their lesson the first time. The scavenging vultures, those Fallen. Always turn up when you don't want them. Kind of like a warlock when you're... Go on. I think... Nope. Done. Done. There's only one ship left on the landing pads. That must be Thumas' ship. Get to it before it's too late. The way's clear. Now let me at Thumos' ship. Great! This is the part where you borrowed it. Like when you borrowed Eris' ship? She will want a replacement, Kate. Eris loves me! She'll be fine. Cover me. I need to figure out how this works. Protect that ship! I don't hear dying. Still in one piece? Unlike someone I know, they can handle hostile technology. Hey, that teleporter was all... Vexy and stuff. Our plan relies on you. Destroy the Almighty's weapons. End the threat to our world. And while you're doing that, we'll get in position for the final run on the city. It's time for Gaul's last dance. Zavala's troops are already getting into position around the city. But they can't attack until we shut this thing down. So, ready when you are, partner. We made it. We're on the Almighty. Good. You must find the ship's central core and disable its weapon system. Your best option will be to follow the fuel stream. The weapon's already active. Are we too late? Not yet. You need to disconnect the link between the Almighty and the Sun before it disrupts the Sun's magnetic field. And everything goes boom. <laughs> Our forces are moving into position outside the city walls. Your signal will start the assault. We'll get the job done, Commander. That tunnel over there should lead us straight to the central core. It looks like the Red Legion are using the planet Mercury as fuel. Strip mining the solar system? That's kind of impressive. That's radioactive and unstable. Don't hold on to it for too long. Four tunnels are clear. We can follow the fuel to the weapon's cores. Savala, your group is in position at the city's perimeter. Understood. Preparing to go radio silent. We can't give the Red Legion any warning. Stay in the shadows. The shadows! It's time for me to go, Guardian. You know your path. You don't need our guidance anymore. If my journey ends today, 
then I face it gladly. Hey, Hawthorne says we're reaching our insertion point, and I'm not big on goodbye scenes. So, you do what you gotta do. Make it out alive, okay? I need someone who gets my jokes. See those tubes? That's how we get to the weapon core. Interceptors. It's like they're begging us to blow this place up. Temperature levels are rising, but it's not enough. We need to disrupt the core itself. A fusion cell. We'll use that to overload the electron reservoir. It's a good job, Colonel. What's that now? Seven in a row? Yeah, who needs the light when you got a fine feathered friend by your side? Am I right? Am I right or am I right? I'm right. Okay. Yeah, that's the rally point where I'll set up the teleporter. Zavala and Akora should be at their marks by now. Zavala, we're in position. As are we. Ikora, ready when you are. Copy. Fire in the hole.
problems with you guardians falling down all the time. Where's King? If he's sticking to the plan, he's right where he needs to be. Now we just gotta get you and Ikora up there with him. Well, this changes things. I'll work on this. You need to get moving. Ikora, Cade is in place and I'm en route. Good luck, Guardian. Attacks the city, and the Almighty is lost. Lost? Explain yourself. Laid waste by the very same Guardian that somehow managed to reclaim its power, and has been humiliating our forces throughout this cursed system. You would know this if you hadn't been wasting your time communing with a machine and the creature who claims to speak with Take it. Take care your tone, Consul. My tone? We will fail in our mission to secure this power and deliver our people. For the first time in the glorious history of the Red Legion, fail because of you and your preoccupations. Look at your traveler, Dominus. The cage is complete. The time is now. Claim what is rightfully yours and take this power. Fixation is over. You have already been chosen, not by some inert machine, but by me. I chose you the day I found you. Remember who you are, what you are. You are Kamal. Kamal, wait for nothing. You will take the light. Do what you swore and give me the vengeance you promised. Look at me, student. Look at me! I will do what I swore, old friend. I am gone. And I will take the light. What's happening to it? Zavala, we're back and ready to go. Guardian, are you still with us? We're fine, but the Traveler... That's why we're here, to stop this madness. Ikora and I are converging on the rally point. 
Kate's already there. We'll use the Vex teleporter to jump to the Traveler. If we make it there alive. We've got your back. Welcome back, Guardian. Glad you could join the party. Red Legion's using these energy barriers to funnel us into kill boxes. I can hack into the grid and knock it down for short stretches. Stand by. Another energy barrier. Hold on, I've got you. Ikora and I have reached the rally point, but Kate is still wrestling with a teleport. I can either shoot or work on this thing, but not both, because they just shot off my arm. Kate, we need that teleporter. We can't hold this position much longer. They're coming at us from all sides. We need your help, Guardian. The Traveler. Gaul found a way to drain its light. It's the only explanation. Guardian, we have to stop him. If he takes the light, it's over. Ikora, Kane. If we don't make it out of this alive, know that I've never been prouder to be part of your fire team. If we have to die, at least we'll die in the shadow of the Traveler, old friend. We're about to die and you're still making speeches? One more- Hey! Don't shoot that! Guardian! We can't make the jump! It's all on you now! Save the Traveler! A working, probably stable Vex gate. One step and you'll be right next to the big guy. Go for the Vanguard. And the Traveler. Make it matter. Oh, stop. You're on Gaul's command ship. It's as close to the Traveler's we can get you. Be brave. For all of us.
humanity a second time. I am called. I claim what is mine. City die! Give up! You have nothing to fight for! Nothing to die for! Places, in all things, you can block it, even try to trap it, but the light will find its way.